Hello, everybody, and welcome to one of my favorite games of all time, really. Uh, so, first off, you might be wondering, what is this game? Well, this is Watch Dogs, and we're going to be playing through it, but not with a little twist. I have installed the Living City mod to go through the entire game with. Living City adds a couple extra things that we'll be showing off in due time. But when I was going through and picking a game, I decided that Watch Dogs was a series that I've always loved, and Legion and 2 didn't live up to my expectations that I have for the first one. Watch Dogs 1, in my opinion, was Ubisoft's last great game they made in a way before they went full open world, crafting, survival, and all that. This is the last good game, in my opinion. And when I look up about Watch Dogs, many people agree nowadays that this game is arguably has gotten better with age. When you compare it to like Watch Dogs 2 and Legion, and Legion and 2 were missing a lot of stuff when they came out. So I decided to backtrack to a game that I've always held in high regard, Watch Dogs. So let's strap in, have some fun, and get to the great parts of this. I, of course, We'll be doing a full let's play of this. I will be covering Bad Blood and the extra side activities as much as I can. I will not be doing 100% though because this will drive me fucking insane. Let's begin! Floating in a cloud of data. I just reach out, pluck it from the sky, and it's mine. It's ours. Stay focused. We got a nasty security system. How much we got? A hundred grand in 30 seconds. God bless the rich and famous. We are the modern day magicians, siphoning bank accounts out of thin air. Someone else is hacking in. Yeah. Let's take a peek. Let's not. Stick to the plan, Damien. Siphon the accounts and get out. Adventure, my boy. Have faith in your mentor. Something triggered that alarm. Let's find it. Oh, shit. You're the system. I'm almost there. I'm shutting down now. Don't you touch a thing. What the hell is that? We need to abort. We are not done. Damien, it's over. I'm disconnected. Maurice. Yeah? You're on. One of our contractors ran a search for the hackers in the Merlot job. You're assigned Aiden Pierce. Take him out. Hit the family if you need to. This guy's hacking days are done. Hit the family? Got a problem? Nope. Husky, I'm good. 
You'll never hear from him again. Gave the order. <laughs> Don't you? <laughs> you don't know. Ain't the family? Not a problem. Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. What do you think, Maurice? Did you scare me? It was a job, man. I didn't know. Who was on the other end of the call? Give me a name. They never gave me a name. I'll tell you a name. It's all right, that wasn't supposed to happen. I want you to think very carefully. Think. Look, man. Even if I knew a name, you couldn't get me talking. These guys. I heard stories, man, that are like nothing you ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Sometimes you can't walk away Please! from it. Please! Who gave the order? I spoke to him on the phone and he told me where to find you. That's all I know, man. That's all I know. Give me a name. I don't know. A name. Kill me, man. Just fucking kill me. How's your memory now? Yo, Maurice! Yo, it's shaking, motherfucker. Shit! Where the hell you been? What? He's talking to me. I leave you for two minutes. Give me my bullets. I tossed them. But you said you'd kill them otherwise. I told you to hold on to them, Jordy. Where you been, anyway? I had to make a call. And you get what you need from Maurice? Oh, you're kidding me. Let's clean this mess up. Stop admiring your work. Hey, that's cute and all, but I'm disappointed, Pierce. I mean, you failed to spot the nasty inter-gang drama I'm creating here. I don't like loose ends. Let's get him out of here. No, too late. Bottom of the eighth. Chicago's ahead. Game's almost over. We are out of time. <laughs> nice shot. Come on, you're not just a little interested in my phone call. All right, fine. Tell me about your phone call. Glad you asked. Okay, we got a bunch of dead bodies, right? We got 40,000 people above us. We need a distraction. 
I called the cops. You did? Oh, yeah, true story. So, cops arrive, and Maurice's little band of brothers arrive, and pow, 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 pow. Jordy, tell me you're joking. No, no, I called them too. Look, we get a messy altercation at the end of the game. You and I slip away undetected. He'll appreciate the plan tomorrow. Great. Punctual cops. Man, all these guys, you grab Maurice, get him out of here. Maurice? What do I look like, a chauffeur? He's the shooter. I'm not through with him yet. Hey. Ugh. Dick. Chicago police! If there's anybody in here, identify yourselves. And we begin. There we go, for some reason I can't. I got another corpse, another viceroy. <laughs> Victimless crime, man. Why'd they have to pick the biggest game of the season to play this shit? I'm trying to ruin it for everybody? Squad, we've got two bodies in the basement of May Stadium. Get. <laughs> Rogers opposed now by Jorge Sanova, who ended with an outstanding 15-7 record last season. We're watching an epic confrontation between two old rivals here today, and this game couldn't be any closer. Big Bay Steel is on this team with 27 steals this series, but Sanova's watching them like a hawk. Looks like it that's a pitch, and, 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 and it looks like... Yeah, that's a foul ball. Rogers not falling for that one. Both men, of course, experts at the mind game. Two on, two out, folks. Something's gonna get soon, and it could go either way. Quiet here. Sonoma pitches. That's a big hit. I just thought about this. There is a scene that could happen there, and I forgot to sit back and let the scene play. I'm moving too fast. Ugh, one problem with this game. Hey you, sir. This is yeah, you, bullshit, come here. man. You ain't got no probable cause. We're just talking. Look, I got my tickets right nope. here. No, yeah. keep your hands where I can hey, see them. This is bullshit. Jay didn't do nothing wrong. Get back now. You're vice wars, aren't you? That ain't illegal, right? Don't get smart. How did you two afford VIP tickets? Mm, bet she makes more than you do. Yeah? Hey, yo, what? Didi, calm down, all right? Don't give him nothing making use. Something tells me if we run you shit stains through the system, we'll come up with plenty we can use. <laughs> I need to see ID. Both of you. Why ain't showing shit? Hey, hey y'all filming this? Fine, I want to see this motherfucker no. online. Fine. I don't need ID. I'd ask you to smile, but it works better if you don't. Hey, man. I did not give you permission to take my picture. Here we go. Jerome Richards, looks like we got a trafficking warrant out on you. That we can definitely use. Man, this is messed up. We got rights? Just keep quiet a minute. You do have that right. Fuck you. And... Boop. Taking the cash, a time to get back to the game. Bad boy. The police are about to lock this whole place down. I'm stuck unless we create a major distraction. I want to cut the power and slip past them. To the whole stadium? I thought you wanted to keep the vigilante out of the news. Everything's connected to the CTOS with serious firewall. Right now, I need to get out of the stadium. Can you find me the nearest access point? In the next room. Well, you'll need to find someone with security clearance. Security guard should have access. All these cops, there's got to be one around. Hey, you Alan? Yeah, I am. You got an evacuation plan, right? Of course we do. Good, we need to get moving on it. We're not going to evacuate 40,000 people so we can play cowboys and Indians. 
But you got an isolated incident in the basement, we can close the basement. I got no problem with that. This whole place is about to fill up with Chicago PD. That's gonna cause a panic. We need to shut the game down and get people out of here safely. Oh, shut it down, I... I can't make that call. Well, then call somebody who can make that call, please. Okay, hang on. Yeah, get me Barry. Uh, uh, well, tell him to call me ASAP. It's an emergency. Uh, so just how bad are things down there? Uh, we don't know yet. We're dealing with a crime scene, though. The coroner's on his way. Now, why'd this gotta happen on my watch? Jesus! There we go. And I'm in. Night, night. Come on, turn around. Ha! I thought you could open that gate!
Are you for real? That's the GPS. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not talking much right now. It's just the beginning of the game. I kind of like to leave it to the characters to talk. Now, there's a certain thing I like getting early on for a main reason. Forcer combat takedown, okay? I enjoy that one so much because it just allows me to take down the big guys. As you can tell with this little video here. 
With that, you need a whole lot of shit. Bottom of the eighth. Mission complete. Six o'clock in the morning somewhere. And that will be now. Right where? Anywhere. I don't want to go anywhere. I want to go to party. <laughs> okay, you're the boss. We'll go to party. Profile people for potential crimes near your hideout. I'll have to thank CTOS one day. Simple breach of their facial recognition software, and I've got access to everyone's personal details. Turn off the blur. Shader is water. Ocean blur? Maybe. Spotted. But 
the profiler do the work. Did it again? <sighs> you know, I never figured out how to get rid of that. Oh, depth of field. Yeah, there we go. That is so much better. Gotta find this guy fast. I don't want to spook him. She must be the woman he's after. <laughs> this guy's close. I can feel it. Hey, we need to talk. There is nothing to talk about. We're done. Deal with You're it. You're so fucking wrong. I'm not done yet. Get I gotta away. stop him now. This ain't your problem. Oh. Oh. Crown neutralized. Anyone now. I know, I know, the party started. It's almost over. Where are you? I'm on my way. Ugh, you make me crazy. Jackson's really looking forward to it. Get over here. We miss you. I miss you too. I'll be there. Sorry, Nick, I need to take this off. I'll see you soon. Good. You got out. Look, if you need some wheels, give me a call. I'll, I'll set you up. Pre-owned cars? You'd rather register yourself at a car dealer? I don't ask questions. This guy gets me any ride I want. And you, if you need it. I just might. How's Maurice doing? Oh, he's all sunshine and buttercups. I'm gonna dump him at my little dumping place. I need him alive, Jordy. Yeah, yeah, alive. Whatever. Goes against your better nature, huh? Well, I'd pop him and be done, but hey, you pay me right, I'll keep him alive as long as you want. I do work for a paycheck. All right, and I think we're officially out of the tutorial. Took long enough. As you can tell, we're now out of the tutorial. The game is open, and we're ending it here for now. You're wondering why we're ending it? Well, to avoid any problems, this game has no replay feature. So in case of any crashes, all episodes will be one mission, or me exploring, doing side things. Oh! Actually, this is perfect. There's a second thing that will appear due to... Due to the whole new mod I saw Living City, there's random missions that will appear. It's always nice to do them. We'll do it before we end the video. They were on to me. ready. Gassed up, wheels balanced, fluids checked, the works. You're welcome. Da na 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 Could run, but for how long? Ugh. 
Gotcha, bitch. There we go, protector. The higher rank your reputation, the less people will call on you. To, like, you know, the cops. And the less likely you're about to get mentioned in the news. Because the higher city will be on your side. And sometimes, it's rare, the cops will let you go. Now we go. I do not have the pistol. Shit. Okay. Plan time. I want to pick up the gun on the ground. <laughs> All I did was press the pick up the gun. Alright, this is gonna have to be a bit longer to do those until I say we get our hands on the main thing. Uh, if you want to get. Oh, fucking hell. Listen, bitch. hurting the guy. Or killing him. Regardless, you've been beaten. Anyway. That's all we have time for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed the quick preview of the Living City mod. We'll try to get those done more. And of course, Watch Talks. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye, everybody.